India is currently the second most populous nation on earth with 1.2 billion people and the Dayak New Delhi post sits right in the middle of this in New Delhi which is a city of 20 million people, approximately the size of Australia. There are 140 people in total in the New Delhi post, nine of which are A-based and 130 of which are local staff spread across seven teams, managing the complete diverse range of DIAC caseloads. We have approximately 40 people in the visitor team and they process over 100,000 visitor visas a year. Our client service team has about six people managing over 4,000 calls and 1,000 emails a week. We also have a student team, a family migration team, we have a referrals team that manages a broad range of site visits across all of India and Nepal and we also have a refugee and humanitarian caseload that we operate out of both Nepal for Bhutanese and out of India for Burmese. I'm the Senior Migration Officer here at New Delhi Post. I'm currently managing the Visitor Visa Program. The visitors teams divided into two sub-teams, the parents team and the non-parents team. The parents team uh, was put together principally because the largest cohort we have are parents wishing to travel to Australia to visit their children who are either working or studying there. I'm one of the team leaders in the visitors team looking after the parents section and the team is responsible for uh, processing the visitor visa applications. The team uh, processes around 8,000 applications in a month uh, and it is quite uh, commendable that you know the team has been able to achieve their monthly targets uh, every month so far. Over the past couple of years, the number of Indians travelling to Australia has gone up to around 150,000 to 160,000 per year. At the same time, we've got around 160 to 170,000 Australians coming here. That means a lot of Australians are coming up to India to have a look at this wonderful, terrific, diverse country, but they're also coming up here to do all sorts of other things, which are about driving that relationship, creating those human bonds which will sustain the relationship into the future. Well with 130 staff there's lots of stories here. We have staff from all over India from the north in Punjab down to you know Chennai in the south. One of the great recent stories is one of our leaders is about to migrate with his wife whom he met at the High Commission and they are migrating to Australia to take up a state-sponsored skill position in Adelaide which I think says a lot about the commitment and the love of Australia from this post.